lose. They may be moved in all sorts of ways against their own um, capacity to act. Most of my friends were in bands. They all were always looking for an old ambulance to use as the, the band truck, you know. And I always thought they were fantastic things, that these old ambulances could be converted into these things that carried our life, which was the music at that time. And the car that was, or truck, that was used to transport people in states of crisis. I started working on refugee as a result of those appeals, and the first piece was the habitat. Probably otherwise, but I didn't write them down. Um, after the this connector, which is more recent, in fact, um, I don't know if people may have seen the work of mine at the Australian Centre for Contemporary Arts two years ago. So I think that in the community arts sector and in public art sectors, sort of since the 80s, there's been a lot of discourse of communities manifesting their expressions and their work out in public context. Where I think it's fallen down or, or that hasn't been validated is that the fine art or the um, academic um, aspect of the art world hasn't really um, address the significance and permeation of, of what that's about. It's that there's been a real sort of chasm between fine art and, and community public art. And what's really exciting about this project is it seems that those bridges are being really crossed. And, and so, and they really need to be crossed because when people of all different communities can come together with all different experiences and, and their expression is validated regardless of what you know, is made, then some really important things get, get made. Um, that's one thing I want to say. The other thing I, I wanted to just ask Lucy was, um, could you talk a little bit more about the content of the heart and sort of collective um, collaborations and maybe what you know, some of those deeper intent intentions are in the work? Uh, our themes that uh, both my husband and I have been developing for the last um, six or seven years, we chose the heart as a symbol that could uh, act as sort of like a federating symbol that, that a lot of people could relate to um, because of its symbolics, its metaphorical aspects. Um, uh, um, and also because we were looking for a symbol which would embrace a project over the next 10 years that would really have some sort of resonance in society. So looking at the question of heart um, uh, and the idea of donorship and saving lives in a sense. So going, taking, taking art um, on a trajectory which would lead it to um, a result, maybe saying that um, in 10 years' time, can we, through the multiple of exhibitions, installations, performances, collaborations, co-creation, participation, say that we've produced a body of work together that has um, given meaning to that and also perhaps even gone as far as suggesting that we can even save lives through the, the construction of the multiple of all these events. And what's been interesting over the last um, four years is that um, We've been working in collaboration with the Hart Foundation in France and they've now commissioned um, several of our projects because they feel that we're communicating a sense of heart and a sense of community um, through the, the different operations that we've been running. So in a lot broader sense, heart is really extending in a tentacle nature out into the community in many different ways. Um, so uh, it's, gone, it's gone beyond its symbolic of, of giving heart, having heart, um, warmth, whatever, and if you can check on the board over there, all the ideas that are coming up through, through uh, uh, form um, that, that's being treated, uh, that Jorge, my husband, is doing there, is that we want to look at it as an organ as well, not just as a symbolic uh, object. And a lot of uh, what we've been discussing in the workshops is you know, how do you go um, away from that form, which is an anatomic heart, um, which comes out of the body into the symbolics and vice versa. Um, so that's been very important in the development of the symbol of the heart.
little apparition. Yeah, to make it a complete form. Yeah. Because we made the decision at that to put that floor in yeah. within the space of a day. Yeah. He's on l'architecte, l'allemand, il est venu. Avec les pieds, je pouvais parler parce que le reste, c'était les gens des galeries et tout ça.